Ukraine strengthens its Bakhmut defenses. Despite early indications of a pullback from the eastern city, which is almost completely surrounded by Russian soldiers, Ukraine's President Vladimir Zelensky has stepped up his defense of Bakhmut. According to the New York Times in his video address, Zelensky stated that he had met with his top generals, who unanimously advised him not to withdraw but to reinforce. It is unusual for the president to cite the advice of his top commanders. His intervention comes amid reports of concerns among Western officials, analysts, and some Ukrainian troops on the front lines about the merits of retaining control of the city. Regardless of the costs on Monday, U.S. Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin stated that the withdrawal from Bakhmut should not be viewed as an operational or strategic loss. Zelensky stated that he had asked General Valey Zeluzny, Commander-in-Chief of Ukraine's armed forces, to identify appropriate forces to assist the guys in Bakhmut. There is no region of Ukraine that can be abandoned. The struggle for the city was added by Zelensky. Known among Ukrainian troops as Fortress Bakhmut, the partly bombed-out city has been besieged by Russian troops from the east, north, and south. The Ukrainian defense of Bakhmut continues to deplete both sides' forces. Sergei Shugu, according to the UK Defense Ministry, Russia's defense minister stated that conquering Bakhmut would allow his soldiers to continue and advance into Ukrainian lines. One of the remaining major cities in Ukraine's eastern Donbass area not under Russian occupation, but it provides Putin with his first big battlefield success since his forces were taken nearby in the cities of numerous Donetsk and Lysyshansk earlier this summer.